Hey everyone, so um, on my other channel, ACF Asian, I did a video of giving Maisie a bath, but it wasn't in depth. So today I'm going to teach you how to, like a tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to wash Maisie. So my dog is a Chihuahua and she's small, so I could wash her in the bathtub, but you guys can't if your dog's bigger, like medium size. You're going to need a hose, so let's get started on with the tutorial. Hey guys, so your first steps are, I'm going to show you what you need. This is optional blow dryer. You're gonna need a towel. So if you don't have a blow dryer or you have one, you don't want to use it. It's okay. And we've got we've had this shampoo since the day we got Maisie. It's Gentle and Tearless Puppy Shampoo. Here's how it looks. Um, so the day we got her, we still have it because she's so small. It works good. And you're gonna need a cup also or like a bowl to rinse the water on your dog. Because I'm using a tub, I filled it less than halfway with warm water and it was a little more too warm so I put cold water. So now it's like in the middle, it's perfect for her. So once you've got that, if you're wearing any loose bracelet or like long sleeve, take them off. Because um, you don't want to get them wet, like this shirt's nice but I'm going to wear it because it's a video, a tutorial. But anyways, what you're going to do is get the towel. Macy's gonna go everywhere right now. Like, try to cover yourself up so you won't get wet. Now, if your dog's new to this and hasn't been in the water, just get her used to it. Get your dog used to it. Let her be in the water. Let her, um, get used to it so she won't get all crazy. And then, slowly, just like, put a little bit of water on her. Just, like, put, if you could see, a little bit of water on Maisie. There she is. I'm just gonna try to blow. See, she's kind of getting a little spook. So I'm just gonna get a little bit, put it on her. So your first process is to get your dog wet. Like this. So you get dog all nice stamped and wet. So once you get them wet, you get your shampoo, your dog shampoo. On your hand, you get, um, a generous amount. Don't be shy. Like this, if you could see. And I'm going to put a little bit up here, a little bit down here. Scrub it in all the way around. You would be doing this with two hands. Um, it might be cool if you have a brother or sister to help you because she's holding on to me right now. And i got to like scrub her with one hand. So you scrub down here, her legs, you get shampoo. Down there you get it on her tail. And then you work your way up here, and you have to hold her, your dog's ears down like this when you pour water on, because you don't want the water to go inside the ears. And if you pour over her face, make sure to cover your dog's eyes. So I worry if I say her sometimes, because my dog's a uh, her. Her name's Maisie. So you scrub your dog really good, get in the tail and everything. And then you could flop them over and do their belly. So I need to do her belly. Oh, this is so hard to do with one hand. So, got some shampoo. Get a little bit under her belly. Get some under your chin. Under your head. Come on, Maisie. Get it on your paws. So now that there's shampoo all over your dog, this is pretty explanatory, self-explanatory. You just get your dog wet, put some water on him, and now you just rinse them off. And this is where your wash cup or bowl comes in. You just get some water and wash it, rinse your dog thoroughly. Oh, I'm gonna be ready for that. And if you want, you could like wear gloves or something and clean your dog's private part too. 
are just, if you don't feel comfortable doing that, well, Maze it! Maze it! <laughs> you have to watch out for your dog jumping out of the tub too. But if you don't want to touch the private part, get some water and just pour it in the pivot and their butthole too. You need to clean their butthole. They're like us. And be ready for your dog to go crazy, jump everywhere, get water and shake themselves. So that's why when she holds me, I like to let her so I could just raise her. <laughs> See? You gotta watch out for this part. There's water everywhere. So I'm just gonna rinse Maisie up and next we're gonna blow dry her with So next you guys drain your tub. Um make sure the water's out. Now it depends on where you want it, because if you blow dry her, or oh, I mean your dog. Oh there's like a little bit of water. Sorry about that guys, but um, you want to make sure you don't drop your blow dryer in the tub because that's bad. So um, make sure the water's out, then next wrap your dog in the towel, hopefully you can see us. Um, you wrap her in the towel, your dog in the towel I mean, and you just dry him down nicely. <laughs> Look how amazing he looks, she looks all, she looks all funny and fluffy. So you gotta dry them down really good and make sure they're dry. And then I like to blow dry her too, so um, next up I'll show you how to blow dry your dog. It's really easy. Like if you put gel in your hair or you're a girl and you use a blow dryer, same. So expect this on my shirt. If you could see there's her hair everywhere, there's water. And on my leg right here, there's like water all over it. I wanna show you guys, if you see the ground, there's water there everywhere. So it's gonna be really messy. So right now, I'm gonna dry Maisie. Sorry, this is kinda hard to do with the area that I have, but. Let's dry Maisie now. So I'm just gonna put my blow, or my mom's blow dryer on, the highest setting. It's not that hot, it's like coldish warm. So next up, you just grab your dog. You gently um, brush the air on them. And I don't think Maisie likes it that much, but you gently coat them with it like this. Maisie looks so funny. She looks like she's a pool or something off her hair set. So go on and blow dry your whole dog. She doesn't like it that much. She really doesn't like it. <laughs> she wants the water and the dry stuff off of her. And your dog's gonna do that a lot too. So that's pretty much it on how to give your dog a bath. Just do it fully and your dog will be all dry, nice fluffy and it, it'll smell good. So stay tuned for future tutorials. I hope you guys like this one. It was more um, informal than the video on my other channel, so obviously. But that's how you wash your dog, so please stay tuned for future tutorials.